Tennessee Hindicourse, Algebra 1, practice test question number 23. Now this is a little bit of a, a different scenario. I'm working with a square root of 2x to the second power times uh, uh, raised, all of that raised, to the fourth power. There's a few different ways that you can look at this problem if you'd like to. Um, first off, I know that square root is the same as raising something to the half power. So if I wanted to raise 2 to the half power and then x squared to the half power, I can certainly do that and I'm going to end up multiplying things out. Um, and then I can raise all of that to the fourth power. Remember, when I'm raising something to a power, the exponents do one thing less. So I raise all this to the fourth power, but less than square root or less than, less than exponents is multiply and divide. So in this case, I just multiply. So I do four times one half, because I'm doing this fourth power times one half power. It gives me 2, so 2 to the second power, times, I've got this x, first I've got to deal with this, uh, 2 times 1 half is 1, so this is x to the first power, and x to the first power times 4, 4 times 1 is 4, so it's x to the fourth. Now I know that 2 to the second power is 4, I get 4x to the fourth. So the answer to number 23 is B, but I don't understand how to do that. That's like way too hard. There's another way you can do it. Once again, not proud of it. Make check sure your X is not equal to zero. If hit X or whatever your uh, variable button is and hit enter. If it doesn't work, graph like three X plus five and then try it again until you get something that's not zero. Your answer may be different. And then just type it in as it's shown on your assignment paper. This closes that square root, so I have to hit the uh, parentheses again to adjust for this one, and then raise that to the fourth power. I get 40,000 with 10. You may get a different number. The number in itself is kind of irrelevant. And then I'm going to try all the answer choices. Oh, look, 40,000 is 4x to the fourth. Isn't that the answer we got before? It totally is. So if you don't like the other method, I suppose you can use that and get the answer to number 23 to be B.